Scorpio, come on in, put your feet up, make yourselves at home. My name is Jen Dawson, welcome to Gen TV. All right, Scorpio, this is your singles reading for those single Scorpios out there. I don't know, August is nearly over. But still got a few days left. Let's see what's going on for the rest of this August for those single August single Scorpios out there. God can't talk. You can see I've just woken up and threw on a nice shirt, right? <laughs> yeah, I woke up like this. I sure did. I don't care. This is my bed hair. Alright, so if you bear in mind, my loves, these are general readers, so it's not going to resonate with all of you, but if it does, take a look in the description box for those links to my Patreon if you want to watch extended videos. There's also a link to my website if you want to book a private reading. You can only book a private reading via my website. You have to come to my website from that little link there. If by any chance I try and find another way of having a reading with you, it's not me, it's an intruder. They are pretending to be me intruding on your lives and my lives and making everyone miserable so don't fall for it unless of course you want to win a free reading i mean do you want to win a free reading take a look in the description box below join the competition one lucky winner is gonna win it what's the date today the 26th i think it's i think it's the 6th that the competition is running till. Right. What does Scorpio need to know about love? I'm dropping on the cards. Luminac. I don't use this deck very often. Scorpio. There we go. Hold on, I'm nearly there, my loves. All right, so we've got the overall vibe. We've got the Five of Cups, so you're probably still single because you're having trouble letting go of the past. You're looking at these three cups that you lost and you're not looking at what you still have left to look forward to. There's chains in this picture tying you to the past. All the pain here. And then we've got temperance, the cause of it. That's why you're waiting because of this. That's why you're still single. Um, what you need to know right now, so we've got judgment in reverse. Don't shoot the messenger, all right? Don't shoot the messenger. Okay, I'm gonna go there, but don't be angry at me. Right? We, we, we're we cool here? This is about you taking a good old look at you. This is judgment in reverse. So, sometimes we don't want to look at us and our faults and our toxic behaviours. It's not nice to think that we could do things that are toxic. I know, I know. Oh God, I've got so many. <laughs> like, for me, oh my God, I just, I just wish I, I wasn't such a, I don't know, rejection junkie. Like, for me, like, the rejection makes me like, no, don't reject me, come back. It's one of my toxic traits. Chasing after what doesn't want me. What's yours? Tell me in the comments below. What are your toxic traits? That's not the only one of mine. I've got so many. I have terrible, uh, terrible manners. I'm like, I'm not like bad in a way. I mean, I say please and thank you. Like, 
like the best of them. But uh, I think farts are funny. Sorry. <laughs> Possibly why I'm still single. Seven years. Seven years. Farts are funny though, right? <laughs> Is that one of my toxic behaviours or my sense of humour? Really dark sense of humour. I can find funny things in really terrible, sad situations. I mean, I've, I've been laughing at funerals. For Christ's sakes, they're gonna sing all creatures great and small at a friggin' funeral. It's like the bit where they're like talking about purple head of mountains. What the hell am I gonna do? Like, <laughs> reading it out, like, I've never, never noticed that before and putting it out to the person next to me, like, and then we're both cracking up on the front row of a funeral. Like, oh my god, look like you're crying. Oh god. Yeah, I find humour in the worst situations. Is that one of my toxic traits? Or is that a good thing? Oh, tell me, tell me, tell me yours. Anyway, why is judgment here for you? yeah this is like you're still single because you're choosing it this is a prison of your own making you don't have to be here you can walk away from this why are you still here like you can walk away from this eight of cups in reverse you you don't you know you're you're choosing this life I possibly might be choosing this life too. I don't know, you just get an idea in your head of the kind of person that you want. Did anyone else notice that, that that little thing on the fence there looks like a sort of laser eyes and that looks like a little like mouth. It's just like a little uh, face on the fence. I keep noticing it. <laughs> uh. Well, now, now I've pointed it out to you, that's all you're going to see too, isn't it? I had to clean the window yesterday because there were cat paw prints on it. And uh, I noticed that during a reading. So we'll go and paint the fence all nice. We could, that's what we could do, actually. That could be quite cool. Anyway, I'm digressing. I just, you know, the way I see readings is I'm just hanging out with my pals. Consider you guys my friends. Anything else Scorpio needs to know right now? Makeover time. I think this is about confidence. Oh, you go out and get yourself some new clothes. Get yourself a haircut. I don't know. New moisturiser. Moisturiser if you're a guy. Makeup if you're a girl. Heck, why not makeup if you're a guy? I, I'm not... I like a bit of guy liner on a dude. I have no problem with that. Some guys are just like... How have you just improved that with a bit of guy liner? Dude. Like Johnny Depp? Robin Zander? Oh, yes! These guys look excellent with eyeliner. What can I say? Yeah, makeover time. I don't know, it was just like for your confidence. You look great. You don't need to change anything about yourself. Don't change your style or anything, but you know, go out and get something nice for yourself so you feel good. And wear it and look good. You look good anyway. It's just, you know. Let's start working on that confidence. Oh, so you think you're a little bit overweight? No, you're not. You're a fine looking person. Everything's in the right place for somebody. Oh, 
What is it somebody said to me the other day? I like my ladies long and thick. <laughs> but not stupid. It wasn't long and thick. What was it? I like my ladies long and full. That was it. I was like, ooh, long and full. Maybe that's where you are too, long and full. Let's see what's coming up in the near future. We've got the moon reversed. I can't pick the card up. There we go. Moon reversed. Why is that here? It's about releasing fear, which I think you need to do for sure. You need to release something. Tell me more. Release fear, release... <sighs> this. You know, the hermit. They're out on their own. Release it. It's time to let it go and... and Start getting out there. Stop joining groups <coughs> that meet up, obviously, you know, with social distance in mind. It doesn't have to be difficult. What are you into? What kind of things are you into? I always see these like groups of people hiking, I'm like, those old people. I'm in a young person's hiking group. And you walk around with your sticks around town. I'm like, yeah, they look cool, but they're old. I want like a young hiking group. I shall set it up. Yeah, you've, you've instigated it for me. Thank you. Uh, I don't know. Church groups. If that's your jam. I don't know. It's definitely not mine, but... You know, whatever you're into. Spiritual groups where you, you know, go and... Do spiritual stuff, dance like nobody's looking, and, and you know, healing noises. I used to go to a group like that, it was great actually. We sat in a circle and uh, introduced ourselves, which I always think is kind of lame. Like, hi, I'm Jen, and can't think of anything to say about myself because I'm totally under pressure and there's 12 people looking at me and oh my god I have this massive social anxiety and then they're like that's cool Jen that's he's good for admitting it let's 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 uh let's give Jen a round of applause thanks guys thanks wow that was that was nice getting applauded for my social anxiety yeah I feel like I'm kind of really opening up to you guys because maybe you need to open up. It's the end of this cycle for you. You're done. You're done being lonely. You're done being single. And uh, yeah, I'm just trying to help you get little ideas of how you can move forwards. Best you can hope for right now. Yeah, you still feel a little sad. How can we help that? By ending this cycle. It's going to take a little while. You kind of have to start learning to love you though. With this. This is you. Queen of Cups. You got to start having to lo learn to love you. Because you're awesome. And that's the next step you need to take. So, you know, maybe those groups that you might want to join are, you know, self-love groups. Just make sure it's not anything weird. <laughs> Still single, still single because I've got a terrible sense of humour. It's not going to be easy, all right? I'm going to tell you that now. It's not going to be easy. But you know what? Getting out of your comfort zone isn't easy. It sucks. That's why it's called getting out of your comfort zone. Because it's not easy. You're not comfortable. Tell me more. goes a, a fear of, of uh, I don't know, 
people's egos and fighting and, and, and you don't want that around you right now. You just sort of want to build something. And uh, Three of Pentacles is about teamwork. Do your homework. Do a bit of research before you, you know, get out there. Like there's things called, what do you call it, like trust pilot, where you can go and look and see what a group's like. Have people said, this is amazing, I've had a great time. You know what I did the other day? Uh, there was something called Go Ape. And uh, it's like these things in treetops where you have to climb around uh, high up in the treetops and, and get from one place to another via, I don't know, some sort of Ewok tree thing, like ropes, like climbing, uh, and it was terrifying, but it was good for me, and uh, I got out of my comfort zone, and I did it, and I, f I felt really good for it, and uh, I don't know, just get out there, do something scary, and uh, who knows who you might meet. I had a bunch of 12 year olds behind me saying, come on, Jen, you can do, I just met them. I just made some, <laughs> made some friends that were just a bunch of kids. And it was nice. Just like, they're like trying to console a 41 year old woman. You can do this, Jen. I'm like, thanks guys. Uh, maybe I need some friends of my own age. I was, I was with my, uh, my daughter and, and uh, another one of her friends so I was I was kind of trying to help them not be scared and like show that I'm not scared <sighs> hard hard work so uh let's get some guidance from the universe for you then I'm going to take a six standard hang on guidance from the universe for you yeah, this isn't what you want. This life, what you're living right now, isn't what you want. It doesn't have to stay like that, though. You can... You can... Sit in your emotions, the negative ones, and... Uh, stay negative and keep thinking this isn't what you want. Or you can make a change and do something about it. And... Be happy. It's up to you, isn't it? Gotta get out of that comfort zone. I'm gonna take this into extended. I'm gonna look at um, guidance as to uh, moving forwards for you. What 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 can what can we do here? How can we how can we help you move forwards? Oops. And we'll ask when someone's coming in. But let's pull you your love lyric for the day. All Mixed Up by The Cars. One of my favourite songs. I think it's beautiful. Um, if you take a look uh, on YouTube, there's um, The Cars, All Mixed Up, the uh, Rock Goes to College performance, the singer. God, he's so beautiful, I can't even, I can't even, I, 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 there are no words, he's shockingly beautiful. That's your love song for the day. And your oracle card. Ha, <sighs> beautiful, the end of a tough cycle approaches. Excellent. Thank you for joining me, see you later.